Hey guys, Comic-Con starts tomorrow and I'm feeling a little bit overwhelmed like I have so much stuff to do um, that I haven't done yet even though I spent all of last week ostensibly prepping. Um, you ever do that thing where like you write down a task on your to-do list but just you like do just enough of it so that you can check it off and like tell yourself that it's done but like future self you just still has stuff to do like I didn't do I kind of cursorily prepped but I'm not like packed at all um, so anyway that's where I am right now but let's take a look here the first thing I wanted to show you was what I got done last night while I was editing my video I put together my new dividers um, thanks to, oh, I'm sorry, I, I would go look it up. The person who commented about the um, pen loop. Thank you. Um, the, I'm going to look into that. The problem right now is I think these tabs are actually too wide and I don't really want to mess with them. So I'm going to go back to keeping my pen in the rings for right now until I th come up with something better. But anyway, here's what we've got. I had a whole bunch of scrapbook paper in a similar color palette. So I went ahead and made... Uh, a flyleaf and eight tabs, all with completely different paper, similar color palettes, um, and here's what we've got. So the first one is this like wordy paper, and I didn't want to use it, and then I cut it out, and I was like, eh, and then I realized that I had laminated a little eyelash in there, and I was like, okay, I'll just put a sticker, um, a picture over top for my HP sprocket, and that way it's like artsy wording and it makes me happy because this is a picture from her first birthday and I love the smile on her face and it's really cool just like don't have a lot of pictures of the three of us all together so I really love this one and it matches the colors so there we go tab one here we go tab two tab three um, this is all, like, I went over the order of things in my flip through, <laughs> flip through from yesterday, so I'm not going to go over everything. You may recognize some of these. Um, I use some of these for my uh, HP, no, what's it called? Happy Planner Micronotes DIY from the first week of the month. Some are brand new. And then this one just sort of matched the colors. So there we go, and that's where the brain dump is. So... Where I am this week is this third tab, and also the, the flyleaf, the front section, is all the stuff I want to go through once every day. But then I'm here with my sort of weekly daily stuff. So I was telling you yesterday how this insert is from my Summer Touch, and it's working out really well so far. Um, I don't really do a lot of hourly planning in my everyday, but... Ah, oh, I forgot to go to the ATM. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. There's a lot of stuff that's like here. I have things written in two different places and it's driving me crazy. So I've got stuff written here on the daily and stuff written on this before you go. Now, obviously, you see this? I can open it up so that I can see both at once. But I like I had this out today at the office thinking about stuff for the, you know, this evening and I didn't want to open it all up like at work so I was only looking at one page at a time and it just felt overwhelming flipping back and forth trying to check what was on the list what wasn't you'll notice a lot of things have stars here I've erased a lot of stars also um, and highlighted some things to try to like focus on one or two things at a time like the idea was to highlight the things that were like the next step that I could do right then so some of that worked some of it didn't I may just run to the ATM tonight because I can. Anyway, some of these things, like, this doesn't have a star because it happens tomorrow. This doesn't have a star because it's just not going to happen. You cross it out. I'm just not going to paint my nails. <laughs> I don't have time. I'm not going to have time for this either. But, like, these are things that I want to get done tonight. But then there's also some things on this list that are not on that list. So I'm just going to go through. I'm going to cross things out if they are duplicates. Sorry that microphone mount is shaking. All right, so diaper laundry I've started on. Story time, good. I'm going to, all right, 
I'll use this one. I was going to highlight in blue, but I don't know where the blue highlighter is. So, story time, great. Cut liners, did that. Alright, and I did these. So everything else on this list, stuff that needs to get done. And then the things with stars here need to get done. I don't know why something so simple seems so overwhelming. You know what, I think part of it is that I was looking at this list, planning my evening while I was at the office. And things seem overwhelming if you can't do them at the time. Like I have just a whole list of things that don't take that long, but are in a different building in a different city. And I can't do them right then, so I just have to write them down. And then it's just, it looks like a whole big list of things, but most of them don't take that long. And then the other thing that's looming is that I haven't packed yet. I made a packing list, but it's not exhaustive. There's a lot of stuff that's just not on here, and I feel like it's rattling around my brain things that I'm gonna forget to bring. So that's where I am tonight. <laughs> um, the first like time sensitive thing is this video. So this is what I'm doing now. I'm telling you where I am. Um, then I'm going to do as many of these things as I can tonight. Whatever I can't do tonight, I'll do tomorrow. Um, we're not planning to leave like first thing in the morning. Um, I think my husband's trying to change the oil in one of the cars before we go too. So like we're leaving mid morning, early afternoon. So I have time to do the packing and stuff. So I think my plan tonight is to get as many of these things done. Then um, I'm going to make like as big of a packing list as I can. Think of list every single thing I can think of that we need so that I can work off that in the morning and do the physical packing of stuff tomorrow. Um, yeah, that's what the plan is. We're probably gonna stay up late. I think we're gonna try to catch an episode of Stranger Things. I could kind of multitask there. Well, I, you know, stuffed diapers or whatever. We're using Sposies um, on this trip, disposable diapers, cause yeah, I just don't want to be dealing with laundry and honestly what it is is that I like to pack light when we're places like wherever um I'm the person who um like I, any the smaller the bag the better and so just the fact that a single diaper basically is like as bulky as the entire diaper changing kit that I can bring for bringing disposables it's just, that's really what it comes down to. Is I don't want a giant heavy bag. All right, that's enough rambling for right now. What you guys get is this video. <laughs> and then tomorrow, um, I'm gonna start my Comic-Con Comic -Con vlogs. So those are all gonna be filmed on location and edited on location. Um, go ahead and check out last or no not last year two years ago um there's a whole playlist that doesn't take too long they're not super long um of the vlogs that i did two years ago uh that's my my goal is to do a better job this time than i did two years ago because i have two more years of youtube experience but you know it's a little tricky on your phone and i'm rambling again all right what i was going to say is guys don't forget to subscribe so that tomorrow you can catch my first comic-con vlog um, i'm not just going to be like showing you all the cool stuff that you don't get to see if you're not there um the point is like this is a planner vlog so i'm going to be showing you my layout for the day showing you what i you know get done and where i go and what i see and how that lines up with what's in my planner and then kind of evaluate that at the end of the day so that's what we're doing look forward to that and i will see you then bye